Hey! Hey! <laughs> hey, I'm going to turn it down. How's it, guys? Thank you so much for tuning in. This is Change Down SA again. I'm Jabu Brown. Thank you so much for tuning in. Where's Mus? My petrol excitement. As in, to turn it down. My petrol no more. To me, I should smoke car, but I pay. As in, hey. Oh, hold on. Ah, hey, yeah, okay. I'm good. It's all the driving. I have to hit the gym and stop driving too many cars. And talking about cars, we're all about cars all the way. And today, like every episode, we bring you the latest mean machine. And you're wondering why I'm wearing green, right? Check out this baby right here. Yeah, this is the new 2023 Lexus. What's that, Nila? Hey, Lexus is saying I'm a wada. I'm a wada wada. This is the new Lexus UXF Sports. This baby looks good, right? Like, if you look at the front, it's mean. This is what they've been doing all along. You know, with their front grille, it looks big from the bonnet all the way. Like, I don't know. Oh yeah, it's actually, it's vents. So there's a lot of air that goes into this engine. Really impressive. This is really, really nice. This one is the hybrid. And probably asking me, what's a hybrid? Really, a hybrid is a mix of combustion engine and electric. So this one has both. So as you can see, it's not like the other electric cars where now it's closed up and it doesn't need much more air to breathe this one it does because it does have a combustion engine and it looks good i just love how they design their front look from every uh, series they have really they have this grill and in some cars it becomes big and like it's just beautiful i just love you should see this thing on the road with the lights on we're gonna turn them it's massive beautiful i love the detailing how the lines move with the spec though, this, sure, this color, this color. Tell me what you think in the comments, what you think of this color. This color is just so beautiful. And the details in there, it's quite nice. Looks like a bronzish, like, yo, I, I'm just loving how it looks. And as we move to the lights, you can see here, this is not Nike, man. Yeah, well, it's if I'm going to Nike or something, Marayo. It's looking beautiful, I love it. We'll turn on the lights so you see what I'm talking about. It looks beautiful. This is the front of the car. Let me see. Fake vents. This one doesn't work. This one here, proper. And obviously this one also doesn't work. But then, if you see here, you've got your corner lights, which are the ones that lights your corners, you know, when you turn your steering wheel. Overall, I'm just loving how it looks the front but then tell me what you think of this front it might not be for everyone but i think it looks good as we we'll take a look at the side profile of this car it's looking like it's interesting really for me it's a bit interesting of what they've used here i think you can take this car off-road right like i think you can uh, it looks like a nice how can i put this hey hey as in sometimes these words they just run away it's long but then it looks very nice i love how what they did here the f spot it tells you it's a plastic in a way but then i think it protects the car if you're gonna take it off road and you're gonna have chips or whatever I think this will protect instead of having them on the paint. So it's quite cool. And this are the 19 inch wheels that you have the front and back, you know. So this one goes all the way type of thing. And this is so clever because I think this you can change very easy. So it's not like the paint where now if you pick up chips, then you have to paint all the car or whatever, then it looks bad. So this one, it's a winner for me. I think it works very nice in terms of functionality. It's great, really. So this is the side of the car and it looks good. Now the interesting thing is when you look at <laughs> this tail light though at the back, 
from this angle, it looks like something that's really weird. But then that's how they designed it. And it, interestingly enough, it suits the car. Love it. So yeah, as we take a look at the back of this car, like it's really interesting from the tail lights to everything, you know, but then they keep one thing consistent as the lines, the line that you find at the front in terms of the, how the grill looks, you can see they've kept it even at the back. As you can see, it's making those lines. So these people are not taking chances, eh? They know what they're doing. <laughs> What's interesting for me is this light. In terms of how they've burned it, like they've shaped it, it looks something out of this world, but it looks good. Especially for this car, and when you look at it from the back, and when we turn on the car, and you will see how the line moves. Oh, so beautiful, man. Like, it's really beautiful. But anyway, you let them know what you're driving is the UX uh, 250H. Hey, but we get used to them anyway this is the lexus i love how it looks and obviously they keep the same lines angles throughout you know they are not taking chances this is well thought of tell me what you think of this bag you know I'm, i think it's growing on me first time when i saw it i was like oh what's happening but when, as I see it now and again, I'm like, okay, I get where they're going, I understand. So don't just look at it, give yourself time and look at these lines. But this is the back of the car and it's growing on me. So we took a look at the back of the car, the side profile and front. Right now I want us to go into, I've got the keys here, these are the keys. It looks, yeah, yeah ne. everything just looks different in this car, you know, so we're going to open it different style. I actually, new season to the Macarat. I, but honestly, I have been driving this car for quite a number of days and I have to say, and be honest, I think the boot is quite small, right? Like, he boots you learn. Hey, mm -mm. Mm -mm. it's not to make sure, but this is what you get. Well, you can open here and put some few things. I don't know. For ladies, you can put some shoes. Hey, I'm not using my lady. 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 But anyway, this is the car. I think they'll enjoy it. Uh, it's looking beautiful. Can't say much. On the side, you get the subwoofer there because the sound system is quite good. And talking about the sound system, let's go inside. Ah, hi. I'm not going to get uncomfortable. Uncomfortable, blind. Even these ones, they could be like uh, sports seats, but then they they feel comfortable. They don't feel like sports seats because sports seats, I, I work comfortable. But these ones, I definitely nice. Very few buttons, like. I thought of it. It's quite different. This car is different in every way that you think of. Like it's 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 just something else. If you want to put it on sport and change your driving modes, traction control. Hey, I I know Japanese. I'm telling you, but this is quite cool. If you want something different, that's a looker, this is it. But I just love how it looks. You know, the layout, the screen is nice, beautiful for your infotainment. Cup holders here, obviously, you press here, 
you have more space to put in there you have your usb there but this is interesting because we can open this side voila i actually since i said japan this is really really cool you can warm up your seats you can cool them like i'm just wow wow i'm lost for words right but let me tell you the infotainment in here is quite cool we'll on it like the sound system it's amazing in this car you really enjoy your long drives listening to your music driving with few friends and yeah space on the door not so much i left my water i would have shown you i don't think you can fit much on the side panels here on the door the space is really disappointing but anyway they also give you a bit of space here you can put a book or whatever service book it sits there and obviously you get a bit of space here but other than that there isn't too much space i guess this one is not for traveling with family and long trips with too many luggages i don't think it would work but this car looks beautiful everyday driving i think it's amazing it drives so well it really impressive anyway we've got two usb ports here oh this is the usb c actually two of them here i think you also have two at the back let me just check oh yes you have two at the back also so yeah automatic it's quite cool like what can i say about this car really i love the seats as i said it feels comfortable spot seats and as you can see f spots this is more sporty actually this is more sporty yeah but this is what you get in the front let's go to the back going into the back going into the back ha ah, guy you know what like i would not falter the seats the seats they feel comfortable they feel nice and chunky like ah oh, like seats tick a box like proper but leg room i'm not so sure hey i'm just an average south african guy i'm not so sure if my brothers will fit i don't think my brothers will fit you know my two brothers i lana and you could show you know like the leg room i'm not really sure about it the headroom though is quite cool and the seats are comfortable you could have three people here it's just a bench so someone else could sit here and you could have other people there only if they are short guys <laughs> like me hey but i knew you short man i knew short i'm not that short average yeah average but yeah like the seats are comfortable but the space for me it's just a bit of a problem other than that i can't fault this car as looking good i love when you look at the spec of this car this is like a deep red uh leather seats which look good in this car with the spec and the color of the car the combination is just so good it looks really beautiful you know the layout everything just looks good for me i just have the teeny weeny issue with the space but please do let me know what you think of the car would you buy it would you not would you buy it for me hmm, how many stars would i give it probably i give it six stars out of ten really for me it's just the space but it looks good everything about it you know just the space issue so yeah I wanna you know pull my je I I put me I'm not in the I'm kaba wa mungane jo mungane mungane hey no man 
Guys, thank you so much for tuning in Change Down SA. I am Jabu Brown and I love just bringing you some mean machines. Make sure that you do go to the comment section down there like this. I mean, this is a press a press. Which car would you like to see on the channel and we review it and what you think about the cars that we've reviewed already. Uh, when we talk about reviewing cars, we're not talking about this one though. <laughs> Not that, you know, we talk about proper machine. It sounds like a proper machine, but it's not. But anyway, thank you so much for tuning in. We really appreciate your comments. Tell us what you think and what you can improve in the channel. We'd love every comment that you tell us. We'll read it, we'll reply. Thank you much. Thank you. Thank you. This is Change Down SA. Washa. <laughs>